We are a few days away from Halloween and wait till you see what we got. For your parties or get together, easy, cool treats you could whip up in a snap. Ann Reynolds is back with some great ideas and Ann, you did all this. And it was easy, <laughs> let me just say that it was very easy, very fun. So if you're thinking about having a party, it doesn't have to be stressful and you don't have to go to the store and just buy the traditional thing. I think what's so nice when you have a party is when you do something that's personalized and, you know, it, again, it, it's easy, but it's something that people come and they go, oh, that was a cute idea. Yeah, and this is one really cute idea. We put these on at the beginning. Half a cookie with some red icing and marshmallows look like teeth. That is it, and they are Dracula's dentures, and they're very delicious as well. You have the red icing, and you just put in the marshmallows. Those are little peanuts. Now, of course, if you have some with peanut allergies, you can always sub substitute something else in. But if you want to do it healthy, also you can do it for the apples, peanut butter. If you have someone with a peanut allergy, you can have sun butter. That's a way to eliminate that. Uh, you can put in the candy corn if you want to have some colorful, you know, teeth in there, or you can just do the mouths. I mean, I think any way you look at it, those just kind of look kind of creepy, even if you don't put the teeth in. Yeah, an awesome <laughs> snack for your kids on Halloween. Yeah. The next one, really easy. Just buy those sugar donut holes and throw some uh, plastic spiders on top. Yeah, very simple way to do it. And we have lots of little spiders here, spider eggs, and you can even put a little sign if you wanted to print it out, if you really wanted to be creative that just says spider eggs so people know what they are but going along with that theme next to it then we have the little donut spiders over here so if you want to go with the donuts and stay in the sweet really sweet realm yeah and this is a great idea because you buy the donut chocolate and it looks like you just broke apart the regular size pretzels I did and it was so simple to do just break off the pretzels where the bend is and then and did you buy these I did I bought eyes? the okay. little eyeballs however if you had some frosting all you had to do is pop some frosting on there and make the little eyes so the theme together if you wanted to do a theme again we have the mouths over here the spiders over here and then we switch over to witches uh, if you want to go with a witch theme, yeah, little brooms. Little brooms, and this isn't a sweet snack. This is something a little savory. Pretzel stick, you have Velveeta, or I'm sorry, the Singles cheese, and, and then... Yeah, slice it up, and then you can wrap it around. The green you see on there is any type of onion there, and the little witch's hat's next to it, and you're going to pop one on. These are simply favorites, fudge, the, the fudge stripes. Pop on that, and you can actually put those on with peanut butter as well. And home decor. Love I love decorating my home, and that's something that these are just came out of my house. This is what I kind of do every year. I like to go with things that aren't so spooky, but you can just put napkin rings on the pumpkins, footprints. I love doing my son's footprints, and then putting them in a nice frame that's kind of spooky. It just kind of adds a little bit of class to it. So, uh, also the pumpkin over there that has the cooler. I yes. know a lot going on here, but. Fun. It, fun, and it looks great, and it was easy. We have a lot more in the project you saw right here on our website, fox45now.com. Click on Fox 45 in the morning. Thanks for all your hard work with this, Ann, and I can't wait to dig in. Eat up. <laughs>